Hello and welcome back to yet another Twitter train segment with me, Yoloka Zitka. Before you go, Manzi, Panzi, Umichalin, Damase, La Payana, on a Sunday, uh, she basically shared with us that she has decided uh, to give her life back to the Lord before you to end. Let me tell you something about a heartbreak, you guys. You know when you are heartbroken... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm speaking from experience, okay? Um, one thing that I do when I'm heartbroken, like isonto same day or same week. And it's funny because in most cases I even see myself as Yabo passed down as a motivational speaker guessana i'd even quote the bible from a genesis to a revelation when i am heartbroken but yeah but as time goes on how shame uh, i'm not the only one shame or head to i'm not do you know then can get this is so call up i'm not saying it's a bad thing it is actually a good thing would he uh, someone would hurt you to such an extent that you would want to spend most of your days with christ and just reading the bible and so yourself wanting to be one with the holy spirit it's actually a very a uh, good thing so i'm even the bible uh, does say you guys the lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit so it's actually quite a good thing that uh, she has given her life back to christ but all i'm thinking about is a hey, i'm just thinking oh mary jane in oh i think i you mention yeah can jing a man like what was she thinking yes we can feel sorry for her but give it at that time when she posted in ganya bantu mary jane google youtube channel yak at the time and then all over again i don't feel sorry for her yeah understand <laughs> she has even decided to share this with us on her instagram i'm not dating again until god himself comes and sit on my bed and says one of my home one of my homeboys i wants to talk to you so until in daughter is it I want uh, to marry you uh, I propose a nails down on one knee. And it's actually a normal thing. I feel like whenever we are heartbroken, most of us, this is what we always say, we'll say hey, I will never, I will never ever trust or even start dating until you start healing again. And you just realize, we'll say, hey, this is a part of life. He isn't as ganjin as Yensege understand. So yeah, those are the news about Umichali and Damasi, you guys. And people are just like, oh, you're just saying that once another rich guy comes forward, or you're going to be like all over him and you're gonna start posting about him and telling us that you're in love all over again. It's just a phase. I wonder Uleroy guys, yo. I just wish to be a fly on the wall there by Michelle in Damas's house. I just wonder. Anyways, you guys, speaking of a heartbreak, Futsi motivational speaker recently, um, Omisaya and Bougie was doing a school tour before she uh, went abroad. Uh, she's having a gig, La Payana Game south korea you guys and she was actually motivating children and that that thing actually caused a lot of stir on the socials because guys we are as parents twerking uh, is a way or is the only way that you can uh, make money or you know being on the socials is the only way that you can make money go to school at least finish your metric and then thereafter but the people People are saying that how can, you know, at like a high school or a primary school invite someone like Osaya and Bougie? What are the children are supposed to learn from a person who's got a BBL? She's constantly twerking. Um, she's training for Amado Da. Uh, videos left, right and center. Like what? Um, principal was school, like what did he intend or she intend? Uguti is ngane zifunde. And what was Osaya and Bougie motivated? Uh, those kids like what was it that she was saying and people are just like if your school can invite 
a person like Usai and Buji, you still need to work really hard. You still need to work pretty hard in order to ensure that you enroll your child that will basically enforce a morals you guys because um, there is literally no ways that an entire uh, school principal could sit down with the teachers and come to the conclusion that this is the person that we are going to invite. Did they do their thorough research about Usai and Buji and the things that she actually does on the socials or did they just like oh okay here's Usai and Buji we're just going to take him as a motivator and there's people like Abo Yol's channel there's people like Abo Pumile Dwaba there's just many other content you know creators that um, align with Iskolo that they, they could have invited but inviting Usai and Buji Nam guys ang vumi like ang ang I wouldn't be happy gives on my niece my nephew or even my son coming back from school and be like oh mom you know who came uh to motivate us it was jelly baby it was Sian Baji it was you know like I'd be like oh okay um who made this decision yeah and i said like i wouldn't it's, it's not something that i would be um happy over so those are the news of the hour you guys usain buji agaham benji as a motivator tina as a skolo skolo as a footy nasema klapini ayegi nganze skolo please <laughs> yeah, I understand. So those are the news of the hour, guys. Please, let's just engage one another down on the comments. And I will surely see you on the next upload. Bye.